Hello, you are welcome. How to solve this problem? 2 raised to power 20 minus 9. Now, from here, let's rewrite this as 2 raised to power 10, then raised to power 2 on law of indices. These two multiply 10, still the same thing as 2 raised to power 20. Then let's rewrite 9 as 3 squared as well. Then from here, it follows the difference of 2 squared, which we can factorize and it becomes 2 raised to power 10 plus 3. Then multiply by 2 raised to power 10 minus 3. And then from here, we can write 2 raised to power 10 as 1024 plus 3. And then also from here, we have 1024 minus 3. And from here, when we add this together, we have 1027. Then times here, we have 1021. Then in the next step, we can also factor this as 1000 plus 27. So we have 1000 here plus 27 and uh, also we multiply by here can be also written as 1000 plus 21 and uh, in the next step uh, when we expand it we have 1000 we first multiply this to 1000 times 1000 that will give us 1 million so we have six zeros now then plus 1000 times 21 that gives us 21,000 then we use 27 to multiply as well 27 times 1000 that gives us 27,000 then plus we multiply 27 times 21 we have 27 times 21 so from here we have so we have 27 times 21 from there. When we multiply this, 1 multiply through first. This is 1 times 7, that's 7. 1 times 2, that's 2. Then 2 multiply, 2 times 7, that's 14. We mean 1. Then 2 times 2, that's 4 plus 1, that's 5. So when we add this together, we have 7 here. We have 6 here. Then we have 5. So that gives us plus 567 here. Then when we add it together, the last three digits, when we add the last three digits, this plus this plus this three, then we have, we still have 567 here. In the last three digits, then the next digit, we have 000, zero, zero. that's zero. And the next, Please, that's not zero there. The next digit, of course, we have seven plus one, then plus zero, that's eight. Then the next digit, we have the next, we have two plus two, then plus zero, that gives us four. Then the rest, we have we have taken care of this zero, then the next remains zero here. So, no other digit here, we have zero, then one. And here we have 1,040,567 as a simplified form of that expression. Thank you for watching. Don't forget this step. Subscribe to my channel and turn the notification bell on. See you in the next class and bye for now.